proof rocks per vigilium. Shall I say I have gone at dusk through narrow streets and seen the smoke which rises from the pipes of lonely men in shirt sleeves leaning out of windows? And when the evening woke and stared into its blindness, I heard the children whimpering in corners where women took the air, standing in entries. Women, spilling out of corsets, stood in entries where the drafty gas jet flickered and the oilcloth curled upstairs. And when the evening fought itself awake, and the world was peeling oranges and reading evening papers, and boys were smoking cigarettes, drifted helplessly together in the fan of light spread out by the drugstore on the corner. Then I have gone at night through narrow streets, where evil houses leaning all together pointed a ribald finger at me in the darkness, whispering all together, chuckled at me in the darkness. And when the midnight turned and writhed in fever, I tossed the blankets back to watch the darkness crawling among the papers on the table. It leapt to the floor and made a sudden hiss and darted stealthily across the wall, flattened itself upon the ceiling overhead, stretched out its tentacles, prepared to leap, and when the dawn at length had realized itself and turned with a sense of nausea to see what it had stirred, the eyes and feet of men, I fumbled to the window to experience the world and to hear my madness singing, sitting on the curbstone. A blind old drunken man who sings and mutters with broken boot heels stained in many gutters. And as he sang, the world began to fall apart. I should have been a pair of ragged claws scuttling across the floors of silent seas. I have seen the darkness creep along the wall. I have heard my madness chatter before day I have seen the world roll up into a ball, then suddenly dissolve and fall away.